everyone, my name is Liz, and today we are going to be creating a delicious recipe with Second City Prime's gorgeous duck breast. Now, I'm pretty excited about this. I think it's gonna turn out really wonderfully. We've got very simple ingredients today uh, because we really wanna focus on this gorgeous duck breast. So I've got my egg set at 375 degrees direct. We're gonna be using our Big Green Egg 10.5 inch cast iron skillet. Now, a, a tip with this is typically you want to bring your pan up to temperature with your duck breast, but because it's cold outside and my cast iron's a little bit chilly, I'm gonna put it on with our canola oil while I cut this in half and score it and season it just to get it a little bit warmer than cold. Now, these are big duck breasts, typically, regular size you would cook 10 to 12 minutes on the fat side but i'm thinking that it's going to be more like 15 to 17 minutes for these and then the other side two to three minutes we're going to pour our duck fat into this bowl because we don't need it for this particular recipe but i want to save it for later because duck fat is really phenomenal to cook uh, other veggies um, or anything else and really it's delicious. So our pan sauce is gonna be red wine, Worcestershire sauce, butter, salt, pepper, and some orange juice and orange zest and a little bit of fresh tarragon. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna put our cast iron on our egg here. A little bit of canola oil. Want to make sure that we get that that uh, fat cap really nice and golden. So we're gonna cut this in half, not for any particular reason other than I want it to be easier to flip in the pan. So just write down the middle here, and then we're gonna have two beautiful duck breasts, and just look at that color, it's, it's beautiful. So, we'll go ahead and score this. Now you don't want to cut through the meat, you just want to get through that fat. So I'm not putting very much pressure on the knife, like Gordon Ramsay says, I'm letting the knife do the work, because I, like I said, I don't wanna cut through the meat. Now because we have a very kind of savory uh, sauce, I'm only going to season this with salt and pepper. That's all that it needs. All right, now into the pan we go. Got a good kind of little temperature going on there. Now we're going to do fat side down. This is going to cook longer than the other side. Make sure you press it down a little bit. Make sure that the entire surface is at the bottom of the cast iron pan. Gorgeous. Now, like I said, we're going to let that cook for about 15 minutes. We'll check it just to make sure. We want that fat to get really nice and golden brown, get a lot of flavor, and then we will take it off and be ready to make our gorgeous pan sauce. All right, so it's time to flip our duck breasts. They're looking really, really nice. Gorgeous color. Actually gonna switch these guys. Oops. Flip this one for a little bit longer on that side since it's not, doesn't have quite the color as the other one. Looking great. All right, we'll be back in a minute to flip again. So during our cook, I moved our duck breasts over to the indirect side of the grill just to bake for a little while. Uh, we did that after about three minutes cooking on the non-fat cap side. So now it is time to pull our duck breasts off. Now remember, we're gonna empty this duck fat into this bowl, so make sure that you've got your egg mitts ready. Our duck breasts are looking great. The FDA does recommend to cook them to 165 internal temperature, just to be safe. So we are gonna let those rest. 
for a minute. Look how beautiful those are. Now our trusty egg mitts. We're gonna empty our duck fat into this bowl and get our pan sauce started. Now be very careful with this. It's fat and oil and it's hot. Perfect. Oh my goodness, it smells so, so, so good. Okay. So, for our pan sauce, we're gonna add some red wine, deglaze. Beautiful. So we've added our red wine. I'm going to add our Worcestershire sauce. I'm gonna add in a little bit, just a little bit of black pepper, a little salt. Now I'm gonna add the tarragon, I think, at the end with our butter. And we are gonna add our orange zest, fresh orange zest, obviously. It smells so unbelievably good. Okay. Got our orange zest. Now I am going to cut this orange in half here. I'm gonna peel a little bit of this bottom for garnish later. And then we're going to use the juice from the orange in our pan sauce. All right. Now back onto the grill we go. We're gonna reduce this down until it's at least half and then add our butter. Of course, we're gonna do this on the indirect side because I don't want it to burn. That orange has a lot of sugar in it. Perfect. All right, our pan sauce is just about done. We're gonna pull it off the egg. You can kind of see that it's thickened up a good bit and that's exactly what we're looking for. So now we are going to take it off, add our tarragon and our butter. Smells so good. to melt that down and mix it in really nice. This is gonna thicken up our sauce. Smells absolutely divine. Okay. Take our pan. Now we are going to take one of our beautiful duck breasts here. We're gonna slice it, plate it, and then put our sauce on top and give it a little garnish and make it fancy. So we've got this cut beautifully. Kind of arrange it nicely. So we want to make sure that we can get some of this sauce on each piece. So now, we're going to lift up our pan and get a nice delicious drizzle of this sauce that we worked so hard on. Oh, and that's perfect. Right, 
so this is my beautiful Second City Prime duck breast with a gorgeous pan sauce. I don't know about you, but I think this looks pretty delicious and it smells even better. Thank you guys for tuning in today. For more recipes like this, please head to biggreenegg.com and we will see you next time.